back to my channel and in today's video as you can see from the title I'm going to be doing a trying all the autumn drinks and treats from Starbucks. So I got a Starbucks order about an hour ago um, and I thought I would just sit down and just try all the drinks and the treats and just let you know what I think, my general opinion and just tell you what it tastes like and then if you want to go and try it then you can. So I'm going to rate the drinks from good to bad and then try all the treats. I only got two of the treats, it was actually three. Um, the only one I never got was a pumpkin spice muffin. So maybe in the future I'll probably do another video and include that. But they only done three drinks. It was a hot drink and two cold drinks. So I've got everything here and I'm going to try it all and just let you know what I think. Um, I also want to say if you're new then welcome. My name is Carolyn and I'm from Glasgow. I'm a mum to one. My little boy, who's five, he's called Callum. Um, he'll be six in three weeks' time. It's just the time goes by so fast. I'm really sorry about the lighting as well. If you if you can, the lighting's a bit bad because it's so dark and dull outside. Um, it's a bit dreak inside, if you know what I mean. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, I would also love if you would consider subscribing to my channel um, if you like what you see and don't forget to turn on the notification bell and that will remind you when I'm uploading next. Um, I know I'm going to do like haul videos, cleaning videos and if I enjoy doing this video then I'll probably do it in the future as well. That's just another thing goodbye, I'm on a direct flight path to Glasgow Airport. Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, and if you're a returning viewer then thank you so much for coming back. Thank you for clicking on my video. Thank you to everyone who's supported me, who's liked, commented and just stuck around. Um, yeah, it means absolute world to me. I just can't describe how much it means to me. Um, you know, I didn't think I would get to where I'm at, where I am just now and I'm just so grateful. Thank you so much and I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, so I'm going to get started straight away. So I've got all the drinks here. So I've got the hot drink, I've got the pumpkin spice latte. I got I got it with espresso roast, whole milk, and white sugar, and a bit of, and a little bit of brown sugar. And um, I got it in the tall version. All the drinks I got in the tall version, and it comes in a little cup like this. This is a hot drink, and it was only one hot drink and two cold drinks. And um, the next drink we've got is the tall pumpkin spice frappuccino with simple syrup and whole milk. The cream has went down a little bit because it's been lying out for about half an hour. I just didn't think the cream would go down that fast. It's also got a little dusting of um, cinnamon. I don't know if you can see that now on top. If I can take this off, off and let you see. You can see that now, but it's spilling everywhere. So yeah, I've got that. And the smell already, it just smells so like autumn and Christmassy. Um, and then the last drink I got was the tall ice salty maple and caramel latte. I got the espresso rose with the whole milk and the white sugar and it comes in this and it's iced as well. I um, also got the treats. I got the pumpkin spice loaf. It's so delicate, like if I touch it it'll probably fall apart. Um, it's just a pumpkin spice loaf and it's got the pumpkin seeds on the top there as well. I really look forward to trying that. I've never tried anything like pumpkin before. I've never tried any of these drinks before um, because obviously I never had a Starbucks in my area. And um, yeah, I'm really excited to try them. And next, the last treat I got was when I first took it out of the packet and I was like, wow. And I seen it on the Just Eat um, app. I thought it's not going to be that orange, but look how orange this is. <laughs> it's so delicate. I'm scared in case it falls apart. So this is a pumpkin spice cookie. It's got the pumpkin seeds and it's got like raisins and it looks like we got is it cranberries or it could be what's it cranberries? I think it's cranberries. It doesn't say all it says is a pumpkin spice cookie with um hints of cinnamon, nutmeg and um cloves. So yeah, and it smells really cinnamony and yeah, I'm really full. look forward to trying that as well. So I'm going to start with the drinks. I'm going to start with the hot drink first because obviously that's the first one I see. So this is the tall pumpkin spice latte. So let's try this. Let's see what we think. It smells like Christmas in a, a cup. So let's try it. Mmm. 
um, that just tastes like cinnamon to me. There's no hints of nutmeg, there's no hints of cloves, it's just cinnamon, pure cinnamon. Um, I don't mind it, but it's just a bit too strong in the cinnamon. I think that just went over the top with the cinnamon. Um, um, yeah, it's too cinnamony. Um, maybe it's just the, the barista that made it, but yeah, wow, that's just hits your nose yeah it's far too cinnamony um, if you like like pure cinnamon drinks then this is a drink for you but for me it's just too much cinnamon there's no hints of nutmeg or cloves and it's no there's no pumpkin there's no pumpkin spice in it neither so yeah that's what i think of that drink um, next one I'm going to try is a frappuccino because the cream is melted and I'm a bit gutted about that. This is the pumpkin spice frappuccino with simple syrup. And this says it had um, cinnamon, nutmeg and cloves all mixed in. And it also had like pumpkin spice crunch on top. But there's no crunch on top. It's just like a sprinkle of cinnamon. So yeah, let's try this. I really like that. Just it tastes like a caramel, an iced caramel frappuccino. It's a tiny hint of spices. There's not much spice. I could taste like a little bit of cloves and a little bit of cinnamon, but there's not much. I can really oh wow the cloves are coming through now and it's really really wow overpowering. I think. Yeah, it's really, really clovey and cinnamony. Um, there's no pumpkin in it again, so I'm a bit gutted about that, but yeah. I like it, I would drink it, but I think far too much of this would make me a bit sickly. But yeah, that's my opinion on that. The last drink, which I hope I'm going to like, because, yeah, it's just, it's a tall... Ice, salted maple and caramel latte. It's best of all with whole milk and sugar. I'm going to try this. It smells really nice. It smells of vanilla, caramel, a bit of caramel, a bit of cinnamon. <laughs> oh. That's just, oh no. That's not for me. If you like a, a caramel frappuccino, you know you get the caramel frappuccinos from I think McDonald's, I think it is. If you like that kind of thing, then this is a drink for you. But for me, no, it's just too overpowering. I'm a bit gutted about that. I thought I would like that. It's a tiny hint of maple. Maple syrup. But there's um, more caramel and then what there is anything else. There's no there's no like spices or nothing in that. So there'd be pumpkin spices. And there's nothing. It's just caramel and a hint of maple just mixed with ice and milk, I think. And it's just not my thing, but yeah, if you like that kind of thing then I would recommend it for you. So next thing I'm gonna move on to is the pumpkin spice loaf. is here. I hope I'm going to like this because the drinks haven't been doing me very well but yeah it's got the wee pumpkin seeds on top. I'm going to try a little bit. It's a bit to fall apart so I'll just take this little bit here. I actually like that. Sorry, I made up my mouth full. I really like that. I like that, that's really really nice. It just tastes like, I could taste pumpkin, I've tasted pumpkin in the past and it's just, it does taste like pumpkin, it's like a hint, a small hint of pumpkin. A little hint of cinnamon and the pumpkin seed just set it off at the top on an extra crunch. Um, so yeah, it's really nice and pumpkin-y and maybe a hint of cinnamon. So yeah, I like that. Last but not least, the 
Oh, <laughs> nearly dropped it. <laughs> I'm going to take a little bite of the uh, pumpkin spice cookie with a bit of raisin and I think that's cranberry. Put it there. Mm -hmm. It's nice. It's nice. It's nice. It tastes like a ginger biscuit. I would say. Um, a tiny hint, I think it is cranberry, it's in it. And I could taste it now, it's like a small hint of cranberry. You, you can taste like the cinnamon and a wee bit of um, nutmeg, but nothing else really. Um, but yeah, absolutely. I really like that. I like it, but I don't like it too much. So I'm going to rate all the drinks and then put the treats in order as well and just let you know um, what's my favourite and what's my least favourite. So my favourite drink I'd say would be the house to pick, then I would pick the ice, salty maple and caramel latte. Um, this just tastes really nice, it's like, a, it does taste caramel, caramelly and it's a little hint of like spice in it. Um, excuse me, and a little bit of maple syrup, but yeah, I would pick that as my favourite. And then in the middle drink, I think I would pick the pumpkin spice latte, which is a hot drink. Um, it's just not for me, it's just too overpowering with cinnamon and just spices, it's just not my thing. So yeah, I would pick that as my second favourite. And then the one I just don't like at all is this one, um, it's the pumpkin spice frappuccino. I just don't like this one at all. It's just, no, it's not for me. Um, if you like like a strong cinnamony drink, we like lots of spices and um, yeah, this is a drink for you, but it's not for me. Um, the treats, I think I would rate the, I think I would go with the, my least favourite would be the pumpkin loaf. I like it, but I don't like it too much. It's just not for me, really. Um, if I, if obviously if it was the last thing on the shelf and I was really hungry, I probably would guess it, but I would probably just take me tiny bits. Um, but yeah, I would say that's my least favourite treat. And my best treat is the pumpkin spice cookie. I like that. I really like it. Um, it's not too heavy on the um, spices, and it's not too heavy on like the fruit inside as well. So I would. I would rate this um, cookie and it's really, really nice and bright and orange and halloween -y and autumn vibes so yeah that's my favourite treat so that's the end of the video I really hope you enjoyed um, watching my little um, trying, on, trying the drinks and the treats um, I don't know if I'll be doing this video again but I hope you, do, hope you, I hope you did enjoy the video and let me know down in the comments what's your favourite drink from um, Starbucks and just let me know your feedback and just let me know how you're doing etc because I love to hear your feedback and just love to hear how you're getting on etc and yeah I'll see you all again soon bye